Welcome, everyone. We are here at St. Peter's, and welcome home to Noonday Prayers. Our Noonday Devotions are posted every week on Wednesdays, and I ask you to consider liking, subscribing, giving us a notification with a thumbs up that you uh, are enjoying this on YouTube. If you're watching it on Facebook, we are glad you're here. Consider liking this particular broadcast um, if you're watching it live or if you're watching it on delay, and then follow our page so you'll get notifications when we come go live with different services. The services of uh, for us, the services for noonday prayers are interchangeable. They come in English, French, and Spanish. Today will be in English, and we tend to rotate through the psalms and the readings offered. The interesting thing about the dance of noonday prayers is this pretty set rotation contained within the office within the service itself. So it's a great way to pause in the midday and enjoy that break and take a moment to be with God in prayer, particularly for others' sake as well as for our own. So we have an order of service for noonday, and because though this is the season of Advent, and I try to make sure that each one of these can be read at any time, I will be offering uh, for this first week of Advent a poem by Thomas Burton entitled Advent during the reflection and meditation period. Welcome home to St. Peter's, noonday prayers in English, Psalm 119. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Psalm 119, a portion of which you will find on your screen. Please join me in unison. Your word is a lantern to my feet, and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips and teach me your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. Truly, they are the joy of my heart. I have applied my heart to fulfill your statutes forever and to the end. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. If anyone is in Christ, they are a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. All this is from God, who through Christ reconciled us to God's self and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. Thanks be to God. Advent by Thomas Merton. Charm with your stainlessness the, these winter nights. Skies and be perfect, fly vivider in the fiery dark, you quiet mediators, meteors and disappear. You moon, be slow to go down, this is your full. The four white roads make off in silence toward the four parts of the starry universe. Time falls like manna at the corners of the wintry earth. We have become more humble than the rocks, more wakeful than the patient hills. Charm with your stainlessness these nights in Advent, holy spheres, while minds as meek as beasts stay close at home in the sweet hay, and intellects are quieter than the flocks that feed by starlight. O oh, pour your darkness and your brightness over all our solemn valleys, you skies, and travel like the gentle virgin toward the planet's stately setting. O oh, white moon, white full moon, as quiet as Bethlehem. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray.
Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit into our hearts to direct and rule us according to your will, to comfort us in all our afflictions, to defend us from all error, and to lead us into all truth through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. By your prayers of intercession and thanksgiving. We pray for all those who are undergoing tests and scans, who are concerned for the state of their health. We pray for peace for those who are grieving and experiencing loss. Remember those who are hungry, who are experiencing the stress of an unsettled life who do not know where they will sleep tonight. We pray for all those who have been deprived of justice and pray for those who strive for justice. We give thanks for the presence of Christ in this Advent season. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Well, thank you for joining us for noon day prayers today. We appreciate your presence and we will be gathering again for evening prayer at 5 p.m. Again, if you're watching on YouTube, please like and subscribe, hit the bell for notifications and you will get updates of when we are posting content, which is pretty much every day of the week, except for Fridays. And as well, if you're watching on Facebook, please join us for these live broadcasts and all things, particularly on these noonday prayers, please do join us and uh, join us regularly to break up your day. We appreciate the opportunity to serve you in three languages, in English, in Spanish, and in French. For now, take care and God bless. Bye-bye.